Good evening. I'm Angie Bevan in for Nancy Cox. And I'm Kevin Christopher. Thanks for joining us at 5. A Corbin man arrested over the weekend in the shooting deaths of a pregnant woman and her grandmother has been linked to yet another homicide. A man's body was found today in the woods near Corinth Cemetery Road. Jacqueline Nye is live in Whitley County with the LEX 18 Big Story at 5. The Whitley County coroner says a man's body was found in the woods off of Corinth Cemetery Road. And just in a minute ago, the Times Tribune has identified that man as Adam Byers, who is the husband of Tiffany Byers, who was killed this past weekend. Investigators say the body was found in a shallow grave and it is connected to the previous triple murder. On Saturday, 37 year old Paul Brock is now charged in connection to this death, in addition to his charges in connection with the deaths of 33-year-old Tiffany Myers, her unborn child, and her grandmother, 74-year-old Mary Jackson, this weekend. Neighbors say Brock owns a property behind where the body was found today. One man, who was just too shaken up to go on camera, says living less than a mile from where the body was found today has him and his family shaken up. Uh, it scares me. I've got six kids and, uh, I mean, they pretty much roam free on this property here. And for it to happen so close to where we live, I'm going to have to keep a lot closer eye on them just in my own property. Brock is being held in the Whitley County Jail and is being charged with four counts of murder and one count of tampering with evidence. Covering the news live in Whitley County from the LEX 18 Mobile Newsroom, back to you.